Hi everyone, welcome to day three of my active challenge. This is a series of key exercises for runners and walkers that uh, can be done with little or no equipment while you're stuck at home in voluntary self-isolation. Uh, yesterday we looked at the single leg squat, the day before that we looked at the, uh, the calf raise and today we're going to look at a really good exercise for hamstring activation and strengthening called the uh, single leg bridge. A little bit more to this exercise than the, the last two perhaps um, and it is useful if you have a step so there's one piece of equipment that makes the exercise a lot easier. Uh, I guess you can use a, 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 the, the bottom stair if, if, if it works out that way but uh, hopefully you've got a step that you can use for this exercise. Um, and there's one or two technique and safety things that I'll go through as we do the exercise but other than that fairly straightforward and a really good exercise to uh, strengthen the hamstrings. Often I find there's an imbalance between uh, the quads and the hamstrings in runners with the hamstring being weaker so this is a really good uh, exercise to uh, to uh, get restore that balance between the hamstrings and the quads and strengthen those hammies. So uh, let's get into it. I'm going to try and do 25 reps of this exercise, see how I get on. So I'm just going to dip down here into position. Got a step here. I've got the mat, gym mat here. Hopefully you can see me, but as long as you can see this bit of me, that's an important thing. So I'm going to get a position here. And I've got my weight bearing leg on the step, as you can see, pushing down with the heel. And my non weight bearing leg, it's not up there, it's not over there, it's the knees are level here, you see. And you need to keep the knees level as you go through this exercise. Um, resist the temptation to you know, pull your knee up to help you with the uh, extension. And the other important thing is to make sure that uh, you're not pushing up so far that you're hyper extending your back and causing strain there. So uh, let's just sort of watch this. I'm going to put my hands on my shoulders uh, across across my chest to so standardize the position. And here we go 25 reps. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, feeling that in the hamstrings now, eight, nine, ten. 11, now step moved a bit, 12, 13, 14, 15, you're definitely feeling it now, 16, 17, my back's fine, 18, keeping that knee level, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, there we go, 25 reps, and that was okay, I definitely, oops, feeling that in the hamstring, um, and not on the back, not on the glutes, so uh, that's really targeting that muscle and there's an element of neuromuscular control because you've got to control yourself, make sure your, your pelvis isn't dropping and keeping your technique good. Again, this is an exercise where technique is key. You don't want to injure yourself or overdo it. Um, and again, if you get into the stage with this exercise where you can't control that movement adequately, um, then stop the exercise at that point. So your aim is 25 reps but uh, you, you might not quite make it. Um, if 25 reps is easy, then we need to uh, change it up and make it more difficult by adding some weight. But that's, uh, that's uh, beyond the scope of what I'm explaining today. I'm just looking at simple, key, basic exercises to get you up to a certain level of strength, and then we can progress it from there. So you've got your calf raise, 25 reps, single leg squat, 25 reps, and your hamstring bridge, left and right, uh, 25 reps, so that should uh, keep you busy. I'm going to do one more tomorrow, and that, uh, that should give you a set of uh, useful uh, basic strengthening exercises for the lower limb to uh, help with your, your running strength and reduce your risk of injury. So I do welcome your feedback, let me know how you go with that exercise and the others, 
Um, let me know if there's any other particular exercises you'd like me to cover in uh, future um, videos. Happy to, to do those um, and, uh, and help you out in that way. So for now, crack on with those exercises. Um, stay safe, stay healthy, wash your hands, look after yourselves, and I will speak to you again tomorrow. Bye for now.